Hey there Libra, welcome to Healing Guys Tarot. This is going to be for your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. This is a twin flame reading. So what we're going to do is this side is going to be you and this side is going to be your twin flame. So we'll start off with you. And this is, what are your thoughts about your person here? Okay, now I'm getting two things going on here. First, I feel like you want a celebration. You want to be able to um, get a new beginning here. This could be also someone you know in work or something to do with money here in this situation. And you can't sleep at night. But you do want a new beginning. That's what your thoughts are, that you, together you can work well. You can also see them as a good partner in business. You can partner up with them, start a new business with them, and you can see them being very happy with them. You want a celebration here. You want to get together. But also, for some of you, now this is not for everyone, I see, you see that it's a third party situation and money is involved. This person might have left you for someone that had money. And that's your thoughts there. Now that's two different ways of going. And then the bottom we have the high priestess. Yes, I think you see things that um, other people don't. That you're aware of things. You're you're able to cross into other dimensions, and you're very intuitive. So let's see now. What is your person's thoughts about you? What are they thinking? Wow. Now there's a lot of money here with this. They see you as very logical, very in your head. And also, um, you are a Libra, so this could be your representing you of uh, no Libra of, oh, I don't think so, or Aquarius or um, Gemini here. But I think they see you as very strict, very strong, and very strong willed and going to cut them out if they don't do things right they also they have something to do here with money finance that happens they might see you as their happiness here you're you bring them a lot of happiness good family life a good um they also might see finances too though this is um the king of pentacles they could see you as a leader, a good financial person able to make money. They might, some, I'm sorry, but this is not for everyone. Someone might see you as a meal ticket here, that you're able to make a lot of money or you, you have a lot of money. You're well, well off here, but you're also not going to just let them come in. And here, the Empress, they might also see you as the Empress here. very fertile able to create whatever you you want in life okay now what are your feelings towards your twin flame why i'm crooked here it's a little better feels weird it feels like your energy feels higher than theirs it just feels like that's the way I'm, when I'm working on these, I feel like I should be bringing this down more. Okay, I'm going to do that. I'll do this a little here. Okay, what are your feelings about them? Okay. It's a burden. This relationship, these feelings that you have, it has, it has been a burden for a very long time. You've been waiting for a very long. You might have been waiting for this person to change, to do something different. It's been so long, so hard. I feel so heavy right now. My energy is just feel. I might. I, my shoulders just really droop forward. It's like oh, so much, so much. You endured so much with this person. 
but you're seeing you've been waiting but you've been now you're seeing things in a different perspective i think you're really tapping into your intuition you're um you might be meeting this person on fifth dimension try to help them to grow to change i, th I think you are contacting them your energy feels so much different than theirs it feels like this is your normal feeling light and just going with the flow but when you think about them you feel this heavy heavy energy this burden and and i'm seeing this hangman being tangled up in these chains he's like trying to be loose and free he's trying to be this energy but these this burden is just pulling him they almost feel like they have control over you like they they can like these that they could wheel these things up or wheel them down and they they can pull you back and forth like they sway you in one direction then you when once you get your energy and you get moving again and you start feeling like okay i'm moving away from this i'm free they pull you back in wow yeah that ending your feeling might be you just need to end this okay now what are their feelings? Ooh, okay, that wanted to pop up. That's the feeling towards you. They feel abandoned, left out. More here. Wasn't ready for that one. <laughs> but that one, right, flying right out, they really feel totally abandoned by you. They can't sleep at night. And they, they're at cross. They don't know what to do. They can't decide on what to do here. They want a new beginning. They don't. They don't feel like they see everything clearly. They don't know how to make a a move or how to approach you, because they're not feeling like this is. They're seeing everything. It's only seeing. They're only seeing partial. They're not able to get an, a whole grip on things. They they feel like they're really tormented. This poor soul feels. I mean, I, I, if they're doing you wrong, I'm sorry, but it it just feels like their soul feels very tormented. They, they don't sleep well okay now what action are you possibly going to take towards them or thinking about taking towards them okay you really do feel like you want to start a new beginning. This feels like a business thing to you. I don't know. It feels like it might be a partner in business or you just think together you work really well as business partners. Like you're on the same page. You want something passionate. It might even be a business that brings out your passion and it can make a lot of money. But you don't trust them. You want to go towards them. You want this abundance with them. But you're not trusting them. You think they might try to take everything. Wow. And then we have the Hermit. You're going within. This is Virgo energy here. You're going deep within and trying to figure out what to do here. Now what action they do they want to take or are they going to take towards you? Wow. Heavy duty here. Okay. So they feel like there's competition here for you. They have to fight for you. They know they have to fight for you. Now they started something and they're waiting for something to come in. They might be maybe starting something on their end as far as their career or their business, trying to make more money or do something. And then they're going to come charging in. And then they might be very impulsive too. They might just come out of the blue here. But they do want to offer you their cup of love. That's the action they want to take. But they're not ready right now. They need to do something. They're they're putting their plan into action they're trying to they they did something but they're waiting i i don't know if they started a business trying, they're waiting for the money to come in now they're waiting for something well okay let's see what is the energy you both feel between the two of you i really do feel like this feels unbalanced okay what is the energy the mutual feelings that you both have towards each other healing yes you both want to heal this i think it's holding you both back Oop. and then we have big dreams you both have big dreams for each other you figured this was going to go the long haul here you really thought something was going to happen and admire and you both admire each other i think you could be admiring each other for if you do work together or 
as a business that you admire each other's capabilities. There is awakening here though. I think this is for your person. They're starting to awaken to the realization of this energy or just the realization that, uh, like you are very spiritual and they're awakening to that and they're awakening they're trying to their energy is so different than yours though it feels so <sighs> heavy burden I feel, I feel like this person might even self-sabotage themselves they don't see things on a like a spiritual level they see things more on a narcissistic level is what I'm feeling they feel narcissistic to me Okay, put that here, but there is an awakening. Okay, now let's see. Let's find out. What are you hiding? Well, there is subconsciously or consciously, but what, what's hidden on your side? What are you hiding from this person? Oh, the world. You want somebody to come back around. You want completion. You want an ending to start a new beginning. You want this to end either way but you want to be able to start something new here and also you at one time I think you felt like this person was the world to you you're feeling okay by yourself you the money you have money here you're doing well with the money the finances I you might be hiding this from them how much money you're having because I don't think you really trust per this person on the financial level you're doing okay by yourself you have a lot of money a lot of opportunities a lot of things coming in and you have the nine cups you have your dreams come true as far as finances and stuff like that and you're you're happy and you almost might consider them your wish come true but they have to treat you right these things keep flying out let's see what we have here two came flying out right away that's hidden for them and that wow they got the full and the four of wands they want commitment here they want a new beginning they want commitment I need one more card but those two came flying out for them and this will also be a business too with the four of wands but they definitely want a deep commitment with you they want to start something it could be um getting engaged too marriage ace of wands they see this as a really good opportunity um, to start something new. A lot of passion, a lot of fire, but there's a tower in here. So they're also ready for this other shoe to drop. They're ready. They're, they're afraid that things might just totally um, explode or not take off in the way they would like it to. They're afraid of this tower, this tower moment. But they do have a lot of passion for you. They want a new beginning. They want um, commitment and marriage. And I, for some of you, I really feel a strong sense of you guys were in business together or could be in business together or you work well together. Even you met at work, there might have been some thinking at one time of going out on your own and starting a business together. But this, you don't trust them. You don't know if you want to do that with them. It might work. But this person feels like they're into, oh, look at this, return. This came flying up they want to return okay let's see what we get here there's some more on this see if we get more with how they're feeling or okay I'll take this one it is new beginning a new adventure waits embrace it with and live your dreams passionately okay so that could be a new beginning for you or a new beginning with this person but there is a new beginning coming for you and emotions are a natural and necessary part of life but they can also distort your perception and cloud your vision in order to see things clearly you must let go of resentment okay so if you're resenting anything here you have to let it go oh boy I just got some serious heartburn I don't know if anybody's going through some heartburn but there's some heartburn here okay this one I want let's see what's this it's my beloved though we may be physically apart spiritually we are always united for love transcends space and time nothing is missing that's what this card here you can connect on the fifth dimension with this person let's see what's on the bottom here Ooh, oh boy some serious heartburn I don't get heartburn so it is um, either one of you guys have it or your person has serious heartburn embrace 
through each other you find the missing pieces so you might have to be um find the missing pieces to even move on even if you need closure there's something here that you guys i think have to get back together <clears throat> whether it's for the long haul or whether it's for just to um have closure here so you can move on in your lives well libra that's what i have for your reading please let me know if it resonates take what does don't take everything if doesn't you know it can't resonate for every single person that's reading this so um please leave a comment please like share and subscribe and i hope to see you again real soon thank you